Bring It On the Musical uh, has as its main character Campbell, who is now a senior in high school. It takes place at the beginning of the summer before her senior year. And she is on track to take the National Cheerleading Championships. Um, she, everything is falling into place. She's working really hard, but it's, it's in her, it's right in front of her, as the song says in the show. And then everything goes wrong. Everything she could possibly imagine goes wrong. And basically, the show is about what happens with what you do next. When your dreams get crushed, what happens? And I think what I would love the audience to come away with, and we all would, is that whether you're a 15-year-old cheerleader or a uh, 53-year-old woman or a housewife or a career woman or an 87-year-old grandfather that you just saw yourself on stage and your friends and um, and that you have renewed you know excitement about what you do. All the moments that I love and bring it on are about that moment of standing on the edge of the cliff with whether it's one person or 15 people and say, let's dive in together. Um, because I think those are the most visceral moments and the, those are the moments that we have experienced in our lives of saying, I, I have to take this chance. There's no other way but to take this chance. Bring It On is about a lot of the major themes that, that we all love, ambition, betrayal, revenge, but instead of putting it in the the format of, say, a war story or a mafia story or Middle Earth, we set it in the world of high school cheerleading. And even though, you know, it may seem like this silly uh, framework for it, I think that these emotions are something that everybody can relate to, um, even if we've never picked up a pom-pom in our life. <laughs>